Hey everyone, it's Melissa. Today I'm going to do a couple of things. The first one is um, I have kind of redone my closet. I have a room that I have shown before called Annie's room that is right outside of our closet. And back in the old days, no, our house is old, back in the old days it had been um, where she had slept. I think she had been a cook for this family. So she had slept down there, slept and she would go down the back stairs to the kitchen every day and cook. So um, I was going to, you know, have shelves put in and, and um, a bunch of stuff put in for the shelves. And I hope to do that eventually. But for right now, I've kind of redone that room and I have redone my closet and kind of downsized and made things a little more manageable. So I kind of wanted to show that. I've also done that with my eyeshadow palettes and I will show that another day. But what I'm going to do is kind of take you in there and show the things that I have done. But this is sort of twofold. Uh, I like to do, I have done probably since I first started YouTube, video that I would call Outfits of the Week. And I would get up every day and I would show what I was wearing that day. Uh, for Monday through Friday and then I would put it all together and make a video of it. I would just stand up here and just kind of, you know, look around like that and show you all what I was wearing. So uh, it would usually be something that was recent or something that I had bought. Um, and I have shared with you that uh, last year was a very challenging year for us with very uh, many unexpected things that we had to end up buying and paying for and uh, just some hardships. So this year we're trying to get some things paid off. And so I thought, what am I gonna do about YouTube? Because uh, I always feel like I need to buy clothes to do out show outfits or you know new outfits that I'm showing or, or hauls. Uh, you know, people we like to do hauls. And I thought, well what am I gonna do? I can't, you know, do that with clothes. So I can buy things occasionally, but you know, every season I can't be buying new outfits. And you know, I'm gonna be cutting down on buying the eyeshadow palettes. I, I'll still buy some, but I'll be cutting down some on that. So I thought, well how am I gonna do my YouTube channel? And I thought, well what I'll do is I will still do outfits of the day, but I will shop my closet. And uh, by shopping my closet, maybe I can discover some things that I had forgotten that I had. Maybe I can put together some outfits that I didn't realize would go together. And then maybe I can call up on my accessories, my jewelry, my scarves to pull the outfits together and make them look a little different. The only downside to that is that it will be old stuff, so it's nothing that anybody can buy, but maybe you have something, if you like the look, maybe you have something in your own closet that would look similar to it. Or, you know, give your ideas and we can share ideas of things that you do to shop your own closet and put looks together. Uh, I don't know, I think, I think I'm gonna to have to be creative, and by having to be creative, it will hopefully make me more creative so that I can learn to um, just look at what I've got and shop that. Uh, I did, at the a few, last week, week or week and a half ago, I did buy four pairs, I invested four pairs of, of jeans. There was a one day sale of 25 to 30, I think it was like 35% off of American Eagle, so I bought my four pairs of jeans. Um, I, the others that I'd had, I'd worn year after year, and when I get home from work, I put jeans on. And if I, sometimes I wear jeans to work and dress them up, and then, you know, I wear jeans on the weekend. So jeans are pretty much my uniform, more so than leggings are. So, you know, those are something that I invest in because I will wear them out. So that is something new. I will look, uh, you know, when my spring outfits, or when spring comes around, I will look around to see if there's anything that I need to invest in for that. Hopefully there won't be. But I really wanna make an effort, um, Doug and I both really wanna try to make an effort to try to cut back a little bit. I mean, we're not gonna do without things, and uh, but you know, there will be things that uh, I'm going to try not to buy as many clothes and as much makeup this year. Uh, sort of my goal. I'm, I'm sure I'll, I'm not going to do a no makeup buy or a no clothes buy, but I really do want to try to, to cut back because sometimes I think, sometimes I will have to be honest, I think I buy things to show on YouTube. I, I really do. And uh, probably things I don't need, but uh, 
it's like, well, I feel like I've got to have the latest or I'm going to get behind on YouTube. It's, you know, I feel pressure to keep up, so uh, I will end up buying things. And that has, that has caused a little bit of a strain, I think, that it's, um, it's something I need to quit doing. So anyway, uh, maybe next week or the week after, I don't know, coming up soon, I do want to show outfits of the day of... Um, of my uh, shopping my closet and what I'll do is I'll say you know like pants from and maybe they'll still be you know I can link something maybe they'll still be available sometime I don't know but I mean I might say you know pants from um, Old Navy from 2016 top from uh, Gap from 2017 I'll kind of label it like that and uh, and if there is if it's still available but but most of it's not going to be avail available because most of my clothing is you know, it's going to be at least a year old because I haven't bought any new clothes this winter. So anyway, I hope you enjoy this. Uh, this week or today, it's going to be a tour of my closet and how I organize my closet. I feel like I've got things organized now. Uh, I've done the closet. We have, we have a closet in this room. We have a, this, this is my son's room. We have a closet that was my daughter's room. And that was it out of the whole house two closets so when we moved into the house we added on another room toward the back of the upstairs that on the other side of Annie's room and then that was our closet and then I do have some things in Annie's room too so that has opened things up a little bit for us to give us some more room to store things because you know when I have a coat closet or uh, anything to store like uh, just anything anything that you store in closets uh, or storage areas we don't have room for so we have to store it back there so I will show you that and uh, just kind of talk you through it so I hope you enjoy it okay this room had been what we called Annie's room and we refinished it before we moved in in about 2000 so about 19 years ago um, so I've cleaned it out I did have beds in it I've cleaned it out and tried to you know sort of make it more of an extension of my closet uh, I put in the corner I put like coat rack and hung my purses there and uh, over here I keep my little this is just an old thing that was my son's a little chest of drawers and so I keep my these are all my boots my booties and then just drawers I keep um, oh jeans and pants and um, and my bottom one, I keep my big, my big scarves. My big winter scarves. Okay. And then, you know, I have a rack where I can put my outfits of the week. And then over here, I have a little jewelry thing that opens up. You can see one side's open. The sides open up and the drawers open up. Photos. Um... I have started knitting again, so uh, I'm keeping my knitting supplies in there, in yarn, in books. And then I have a you know a bunch of baskets, and then I have a real old chest of drawers that, oh gosh, that might have, that was my ex-husband's when, no, that was Doug's when he was a little boy. It was Doug's when he was a little boy, so we just kind of refinished it. But I keep, I have three flat purses that I keep there. And then I keep uh, leggings and shorts in these, one of these down here. And um, let's see what I keep in here. Oh, t-shirts. So that's that. And then right here I keep my scarves. These, this is a shoe rack that I hang over the door and I keep my scarves there. Now I'm in the regular closet that we had, that we built on. So I've got that. This is where I keep my regular shoes. And um, this is where I keep the t my, my tops. Now, what i done, I know that, um, you know, you're supposed to do your tops by color. But I can't do that for some reason. What, ha what happens is I, I end up reaching for my black all the time. So I have a whole section of black that I use and I never use anything else. So what I do is I, I start from the right over here. And I go here and go backwards. So when I wash something and wear it, I hang it over here to the left. So by the end of the season, I look at all the stuff that's left over on the right. If I haven't worn them all season, then I'm probably not going to, and I can donate them. So that's kind of how I keep track of them, of everything. It, I don't know. It may be, that may not work for anybody else, but it, 
it sort of works for me that that kind of works best for me there's my white weights <laughs> there's my weights that I use then right here I've got a few pairs of pants and a couple of skirts right there and then behind me these are my dresses these are Doug's suits over here <laughs> these are my dresses for work and a couple of coats so I keep all my earrings so here's what it looks like from this angle walking back into Annie's room so that is my closet tour uh, you know I haven't done a whole lot in Annie's room yet my hope is to eventually I uh, have mentioned it before in a video this is the wood that was originally in the room this wood right here that real old blue uh, milk wash blue that they used to use a long time ago that's what was all over the uh, the walls of Annie's room so we saved it when we took it down and redid it and we had this little closet built right here and then I'm hoping to get some shelves done for for Annie's room someday um, built-in shelves we're gonna have some built-in down here and then some built-in over there and then against this wall and against this wall I'll eventually you know do something else with those pieces but you know they're fine for now so that is what I'm going to be doing and I will start showing you shopping my closet hopefully I can come up with some cute outfits thank you so thank you so much for watching I really appreciate it I'm I'm excited about doing this uh, I hope that it will help me to be more creative with my clothing and uh, and I hope you enjoy it so I'll talk to you in a couple of days and I appreciate you watching so much bye bye